Yo, what's up everyone? This is Zach here with the Abide by Reality YouTube channel and I'm here to continue the repack opening that I had and as you can see from last time that video was bad. I didn't pull anything good. I only pulled one shiny and that went for like a couple cents. I was literally crying how bad that was. That was terrible. But today I will be opening one pack and this is the pack of the 20 rare or betters and this is a $10 pack and do I expect to pull anything good out of this even though there's better chances? I really don't man, I, I, I don't. Like I think I have a better chance of just like buying like 10 Baja Blast Zeros and like enjoying those. And to wash it down with I got the Mountain Dew Bob Job Blast. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes, good. I love the Bob Job Blast. My favorite Mountain Dew. I think that'd be a better deal than like buying these at all. But maybe I do get something good out of that, you know. But honestly, I'm just thinking I'm getting 19 rares, just the shiny lettering cards. But first, I'm actually gonna open these and remember that I got 10 of the regular like doo-doo packs, I can call them, where you just get like commons and commons and like 1% chance of a rare or better. So I'll just open these first and leave the God pack last. Like a God pack is basically like a card, like a deck full of good cards. But I don't even know if I wanna call it a God pack. But what's up guys, how y'all been doing? Like, been enjoying the new content? And, you know, just comment and tell me what you wanna see next time. I have some videos brewing. I still have to do a video on someone on Discord and that's coming soon. I haven't made it yet, but hopefully that'll be soon. So let's get right back to these terrible packs. Like I said, these are just old packs and a bunch of cards that I got before. Like I said, man, you get no variety. You get the same cards. Like, it's just like from the old packs. And like, man, like these are just like boomer cards, basically. <laughs> just like terrible, but what did I expect, really? I mean, these cards would probably be good like in 2004, but you know, obviously 17 years too late. But our last doo-doo pack, maybe. We get a blue eyes in here or a dark magician girl. Do I expect it? Probably not, but you know, you never know. So let's get right into it. Dark Paladin, okay. Valkyrian, okay. Book of Moon. Man, this is like straight out of a Yugi Moto or like Yami Yugi like deck profile. Like literally, th these are all his cards. Okay. And that's the last of those packs. So like I said, the $2 packs, I wouldn't buy them on eBay. And I'll link if you're curious to see like if you want to get them. But I would say steer clear of those. But all right, it's time to open the big boy of this video. And it's the 20 rares or better, which I'm having a difficult time opening. Like cry about it though, and right off the bat, that one was a little bent. So, wow! Like I, like I showed you like last time, the link uh, holographic that I pulled from like the regular repacks, like the ones I opened on the last video, man, very bent. So we got a Drytron Eclipse as a regular rare, an Evil Twin Challenge. So these are newer cards that we're seeing, and like I said, like I called it regular rares. Look at this man for ten bucks, really? Look. Just regular like shiny lettering. But like I said, this is pretty much what I expected. Probably get one shiny card. That's it, look at, yeah, look at this, man. This is just, wow, this is straight up terrible. A Nightmare Unicorn. And I wonder which set that it's from, because that looks familiar. Well, I, I know Nightmare Unicorn is popular, but did we really get, Dude, they said no duplicates. Look at this. Wow. You already know what the review is going to be on this. And wow. So, 
out of 20 cards, 20 cards for $10, you get 20 regular rares with chances of rare or better. And you already know what I'm gonna say about this. This is absolute crap. And from the seller with 100% reviews, I'm not gonna give him a negative review because you know, he, he did give the cards, but, and you're taking a chance, but I'm gonna say it right now, don't buy these. This is a terrible deal. You can probably get a better one from a seller who is like a single seller. Cause I think this seller, like, um, it's like a store, I think. But yeah, I would at least spend a little bit more money. Like if you want to do like a mystery thing, like for Yu-Gi-Oh or Pokemon, don't, I wouldn't get, get anything from these guys. Cause you saw the crap that I pulled. This is like horrendous. This is terrible. They will have you down bad if you trust them with the money. Cause I, I literally like wasted like $30 in total on these videos. I was at least expecting maybe one or two shinies, but not even one shiny card. Just nothing but rares. Like, this is like bad. But now I know not to trust the seller or this product. But anyways, guys, like I said, this review for this is, oh no, like definitely don't buy from me, from this group. Anyways, guys. Man, hopefully next time with the Pokemon stuff, that'll go better. The mystery on that mystery boxes, because I think those are, will go a little bit smoother. And the seller seemed like he was good, but we'll see. But anyways, guys, until next time, don't forget to abide by reality.